All right, this is Dave. Dave's going to explain a little bit about what he's got here. As you can see, he's going to do a bolt hole. Well, you can't see that yet, but he's going to set it up to do a bolt hole pattern. This piece of aluminum here. So, Dave, uh, show them how you enter the program manually. All right, here we go. It's uh, just going to uh, edit. I already have the program in here. What I'm going to do is take a three quarter inch end mill and go around the periphery of this block and then hit it with a uh, 20 hole bolt circle. Uh, it's easy enough to do this if uh, I'll just hit it into edit and then uh, recall event one, which is uh, where I was going to start with this three quarter inch end mill, which is minus. Uh, two and a half inches off, and then uh, I have a program for a three and a half volt circle, so or a three and a half circle. So my first move is to Y in at uh, zero, and then we're going to go into the next uh, page forward is the arc event. So then what I'm going to do is head down to Y minus. One inch 750, and it's causing up my uh, center, X0, Y0, and a 20 inch feed rate, tool offset left, direction, we're going clockwise. So, okay. the next will be another arc, which will start at the bottom where we left off, and go to Y positive, one inch 750, same center line, same arc, clockwise, tool offset left, and then another mill event to get the end mill off the part. And we're going X positive two and a half. Okay. Okay, then we're going to end here at none, and then we're going into a bolt hole pattern. All right. So let's go ahead and get a tool in there. <coughs> I do have uh, power draw bars on sale right now that you can purchase for this mill. Um, I would sell you a Torquerite power draw bar that was remanufactured by the uh, manufacturer. Uh, it just, it just, it's basically a factory rebuild. Um, the unit wasn't used, uh, but for uh, display or something like that, it was taken off and not used. But they go through and make sure everything is uh, fully functional. It does come with the full factory warranty. And I will sell them for $400. So if you're interested in a power draw bar for this machine, let me know. So what we'll do is we'll just touch off our zero, go back into our DRO mode. Z zero out. I won't get too crazy with the depth of cut on this because uh, I don't have any coolant running on it. So now what I'll do is I'll hit my mode. Uh, and then I'll hit, uh, hit run, start, and then I'll go into the position. I already have my zero, so let's go quarter inch deep. Okay, that was programmed for uh, 750 end mill, and we had programmed for a three and a half bolt pattern. Okay. Now what we're going to do is change over to the drill kit.
then start our boat hole pattern. Alright, and that's going to conclude this video.